This video is going to demonstrate how to edit an existing flip chart. If I move my mouse here, you'll notice that it just remains the select tool, the pointer icon. But if I move it down here, you can notice that it turns into a crosshair, so I can actually move this set of text around. Or I can double click in here, and we'll see my flashing cursor. I'll move this here so it's easier to see. And then at this point, I can you know put in a period. I can um, backspace and remove a word uh, to put in some other text if I wanted to. Put this back here. But as you notice, like I can't move this this word here. I can't edit this word here. What we're going to want to do is turn on design mode. There's two ways to do it, but if we click this little snowflake from blue to red, we'll go back to this word here, and notice now I can move it around, or I can double click in there, and I can edit that particular piece of text. To go back, I go out back into presentation mode, and now as you see, I cannot move that piece of text around. To further demonstrate, I'm going to go to the next slide. As you notice, there's I can't move this bit of text around, and I can't move this little guy around either. So I go into design mode. So I could say move this guy over here. Go into design mode, and I can move this guy over here. I can then say highlight this, maybe change the color make it bold, go back into presentation mode which is blue and now again I can't move these around by clicking on them. The last what I, the last piece I can demonstrate here, one last element I want to demonstrate is adding some text to this page. I can go to my resource browser and I type in the word I'm looking for say map can find the map I want, click, and drag it out onto the screen. I've got my little boxes around the edges so I can edit, kind of move the screen size around a little bit, and I can move my image around. This has been a very simple demonstration on how to edit an existing flip chart.